trap. It's going to cut off. Power lines and blow around unsecured objects. Snow will attempt to fill back and across the area on Friday night into Saturday for some additional snow accumulations. From Friday afternoon through Sunday, it's literally going to cut off. 48 hours where temperatures remain in the single digits is possible. This combined with the strong winds would allow for a long period of wind chills well below zero and increase exposure risk and infrastructure concerns across the area. Monitor the latest forecast for updates on this situation. Hmm. Here is a hazardous weather outlook. Dangerously cold wind chills possible. Wind chill watch. Wind chills as low as 20 below zero. Wind gusts of 40 to 50 miles an hour are expected Friday into Saturday afternoon. Impacts, the dangerously cold wind chills could cause frostbite on exposed skin in as little as 30 minutes. Strong winds could produce damage to trees and power lines, resulting in scattered power outages. Winds may gust over 40 miles an hour Friday afternoon through Saturday evening. Monitor the latest forecasts and warnings for updates on this situation. Weird. Another one? W W 
www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood turnaround don't drown when encountering flooded roads most of flood deaths occur in vehicles report flooding to the national weather service by calling toll free 800-401-9535 when you can do so safely
southwest winds 20 to 30 miles an hour with gusts up to 60 miles an hour expected. Where, portions of east central Indiana and central and west central Ohio. When, from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Thursday. Impacts, damaging winds will blow down trees and power lines. Widespread power outages are expected. Travel will be difficult, especially for high profile vehicles. People should avoid being outside in forested areas and around trees and branches. If possible, remain in the lower levels of your home during the windstorm and avoid windows. Use caution if you must drive. Now here is the official National Weather Service. Here are the new 